Welcome all. Today in this session, I'm going to tell you how you can write a Java program to find the sum of numbers in a given string. So for example, if your input string variable is four Pradeep seven Chan three Nalwal, then your output should be sum of all the digit in a string is 14. Here you can see in a string I'm using four, uh, so three digits like four, seven and three. So sum is 14 here. So now I'm going to write a program for that. First, so first of all, I will create a main method here. And in the main method, I will create a input uh, string variable so that I can take the input from the user or currently I'm using the hard coded value here. So after that, I will take the variable sum equal to zero. The purpose of this variable is to store the sum of all digits in my input string. Okay, so then I will take a for loop here and this for loop I will start from i equal to zero and i less than input string dot length so that uh, actually in this loop I will read one by one uh, character from my string here. Okay, so now in this loop I will put a if condition here in the if condition I'm going to write this thing. I'm going to write a, a use a function that is called character dot is digit. The purpose of this function is that it will actually tell you if the uh, input, if you are passing any parameter in this function, and if that is a digit, it will return true. Otherwise, it will return false here. So in the condition, I'm checking character dot is digit. So in digit, I will pass one by one character. So that's why I'm passing input str dot caret i. So in this loop, because this loop is running from i equal to zero, so one by one, it will uh, take one by one character here. And if it is a digit, then the control will go within the if block here. And in the if block, what I'm doing, I'm just storing the sum of, uh, you can say character like sum equal to sum plus. I'm using a function of a character class. And what is that character dot get numeric value and then passing the character here. So the use of this uh, get numeric value function of a character class is that if you're passing any character here, it will get the numeric value for that. For example, if I'm uh, passing it here a four, so it will treat it because it is a character by default in my string, but it will be treated as a, you can say, numeric value. And when this for loop will be completed, at the end of the for loop, I will print this statement, sum of all the digit in the string, and it will print the sum here. So in this way, you can achieve this uh, program where you can get the sum of all the digit in the given string. If you uh, you want to uh, uh, get this complete code on your uh, local machine, you can get it from my, uh, you can say git repository. Uh, this is the program, let's make automation underscore sum of numbers in string here. So you can simply go to my git repository. I will share the link in the description of this video. When you go to the repository, you can simply click on this code section. When you click on code section, this pop-up will be up there. And here you can click on the download zip and uh, it will download all the programs here. And then you can find this file also. So now if you like the video, you can click on the like button. If you have not subscribed my channel till now, you can subscribe it. And please don't forget to click on the bell icon so that you can get the notification about my upcoming videos. Thank you.